exactly. It's a holiday. Yes, I am the infamous a holiday. So I'm going to share a couple of tips I have for you guys. And it's not no major big tips. It's just simple things that you know you would use on your daily basis. But for one, I would say use Google Maps. If you have an iPhone, I know your phone comes with Maps. Don't get me wrong. Maps is good to use. But I definitely like Google Maps better only because they pick up exactly the exact locations even if it's something that's off in the woods it will definitely pick it up better than maps will but i can say the app maps is good for if you're trying to find restaurants or if you're trying to find clubs or whatever you're trying to find type in nightlife and maps and you will see so many clubs pop up <laughs> No, but seriously, I like Google Maps a little better, but I do think maps do come in handy a little, but I th definitely think I like Google Maps better. My second tip would probably be um, if, you're, if you're unemployed when you move, this would be very helpful for you. But if you're unemployed, I would definitely say your job is to get a job. And what I mean by that is... Um, although you don't have a job, still get up in the morning, 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. And between that time, look for a job. I know it's going to be very hard getting up because you're like, what am I getting up so early for? But I promise you, it will definitely work. Look for a job between those hours. And between those hours, 9 a.m. to 5 p.m., um, honestly, you should have did over 20 applications. So at the end of the week, you have about, what, 100 applications? And someone should be calling you. And if not in a week, maybe the next week. That's 200 applications. It doesn't matter. Um, my third tip would definitely be um, if you don't have a support system, try to make one. I'm, I'm telling you, honestly, you, you're not going to be able to move alone and not have a support system. You're going to need that that strength. And don't get me wrong. I get my strength and guidance from God. But my boyfriend is also my second support system. Um, he helps me with a lot. He helps me. To remind myself that I'm here for a reason and I have to get things done. And that I can't be in the bed crying or I can't be sobbing or I can't just be eating my life away. You know, get up, go exercise, go take a walk around the park, go fill out more applications, take a break, take a nap, then get right back to it, filling out more applications. If you have anyone negative in your life, block them out. Just block them because I'm telling you, you're going to already go through a depression moment when you're moving. So you don't need any negativity in your life. You just need to be focused on what you're doing and what you got going on. I hope you guys liked the video and I hope that you took something that was very beneficial to you that you can use when you get ready to move to another state. Make sure you guys like the video and subscribe to my channel. And if you want to follow me on any of my other social media, all of it will be listed in the description box. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Later!